They'll come over the bulkhead into the backyard. That's what that's a way of life here now. LJ Cazzo is accustomed to flooding in his Venetian Isle subdivision. I see coastal erosion and I see how fast the land is sinking away and the water's coming up. I see it all the time in the boat. His home took in 10 feet of water during Hurricane Katrina. It's now raised 17 and a half feet. It took two years for the work to to be completed. And according to new maps by the Gulf Restoration Network, his neighborhood would be in a state designated resettlement zone by 2062. Probably need a boat to get here by then, huh? It'll be on the water. I wouldn't doubt it. And the state's coastal master plan due to be released next year. Areas that would flood more than 14 feet during a storm are deemed unsafe and a resettlement zone. That includes parts of Lower Plaquemines and St. Bernard parishes, also parts of Homa, Thibodeau, Kenner, Metairie, and even New Orleans. The state has said it will not invest in assisting people with flood risk reduction in those areas. Instead, it suggests anyone living there voluntarily relocate. But if community members are going to be safe, they need to be told directly what their flood risk is in a really clear and understandable way. And then they need to be provided with the options necessary in order to either elevate or to move. Caso says he understands the risk, but right now he's staying put. If I need a boat to get to my house, I'm I, I might rethink this. Cross that bridge when it comes. Absolutely. I might need a bridge <laughs> to get to the house.